Badger State Roleplay. I'm this year about to, to show you guys a new MLO that was added back into the game. It must have been taken out for some reason, but he added a lot of MLOs back into the game. And basically, the MLO I'm about to show you is just me having fun going bowling. I'm about to show you the bowling alley, and yes, we can play bowling. And this is going to be fun because not only can we play pool now, we could play bowling and he added the darts back in. I'm not sure how the darts are going to work. Um, maybe we'll try that at the end. But I know bowling and pool are my favorite things to do in GTA 4. And now we could do it here in the 5M servers. Especially now that this is my only server that I could do it in. And that is none other than basically Badger State Roleplay. I mean, I think it's going to be my new home thinking so there we go let's, let's, park, let's park on up let's make sure this is my personal before I get off even though I think I'm not in the patrol area but I'm just here testing things out and reviewing the server as of right now with all the MLOs and everything this server is about to be a 10 out of 10 and bumping it up to a 9 since he's got bowling now once I start getting some real actual RP and actually maybe get arrested or something to see how cops really are when I do something. And we'll see. Yes, this is the OCRP bowling alley. Yes, this is exactly what they have in OCRP. Yes, we could bowl. This is amazing. Alright, uh, so we gotta hit A and then we're gonna type in my name. Uh, let's put in multi flowers. All right, let's start. Oh, wait. Let's do making. All right, I don't know what's going on. Oh, we can put money in this. Oh, there we go. We had to register it. And now we can hit start. Ah, oh, there we go. Ah. And I think I gotta come over here and grab my ball. Ah, oh, there we go. Hey, did we come over here? It's been years since I've been bowling, man. I can't wait to take Dicky here. We can go bowling tomorrow. Just, just make a day out of playing some pool, going bowling, and playing some darts and drinking beer, man. All right. Okay, so I got a. That's uh, probably an X. Uh, press. Select the initial bowling ball position. Well, how do I uh, do it? Oh, there we go. We hit the RT and the controller. Let's try it. Let's see what we get, man. Oh, oh, oh. No, that wasn't terrible, but it wasn't the greatest. Now we gotta wait for the ball to come back up. Okay. And then we hit left bumper to grab it. Alright. Left bumper to go here. Right trigger. And then the right trigger. And then the right trigger. And then we right trigger again and we throw the ball and boom ah oh, come on that should have been a spare 
That one didn't go down. God damn it. Fuck. Let's go again. Alright. I'm definitely liking this. A lot. This is amazing, man. Oh, no. Alright, alright. Okay, I'm getting off. To, I'm sorry. Lady yelling at me. Tell me to get out the lane. I didn't mean to, man. It's been a minute. Alright. Yeah, let's try it this way. See what I get. Well. Basically the same maneuver I got last time. Fuck. Let's try again, man. I'm not gonna give up and play a full game. Yeah, right? Let's see. Let's see if I can get it. Oh, oh, no, no. Ah. I tried curving it. Alright, let's grab the ball. Go over here, set up. Alright, let's. Boom. Boom. And boom. Let's go. Come on, strike, strike, strike. Ah, I was close. It was just one short. That yeah, was a nice one. This better be a spear. Come on, Mickey. It's only one ball. I mean, only one pin. You got this, man. Alright. Uh, yeah, I, I think I fucked up a little. Alright, we'll see. I think I fucked up. Yep, I fucked up a lot. Fuck! It's been years since I've been bowling, so... Can't complain. But we haven't been able to do this for years. It's been closed. I don't know why. I always used to, I always used to ask the city, like, Why well, you guys gotta close down? Like, what is, what, Can't go out and have fun? Ah, oh, damn. Knock the corner one down. Damn, I'm rusty as hell. But then again, me and Dickie, we said that we can fish. We used to be good, and we can't fish. Oh, the game's over, I think. Damn. There you have it. Let's go check out the rest of this place. Alright, let's see. I can pick up the ball still. No, I gotta register a new game, I think. That's pretty cool. But this is basically like the exact style of the GTA 4 Bowling Alley, I believe. I'm not 100% sure, I think this is. I believe it's the one that's in like the second city? When you finally unlock the bridge and get to go to the second city? I miss GTAs that did that. Where they had the cops and you, you couldn't go to certain cities until you got so far in the game. GTA 5, you could just explore the whole city. And they got a little burger shot over here. See, the only thing that is kind of like... I don't get is... Like, I love this MLO. And I've always said it with OCRP and other people I see that have this MLO. Why is there a Clifton Bell outside? But yet... There's a burger shot inside here. Like, I miss the Clifton Bells, man. Like, they, they were, didn't there used to be another restaurant, too? I remember GTA 4 had the Clucking Bells. I remember it had uh, the Burger Shots. Oh yeah, what happens in the San Andreas PJ joint we used to be able to go to? Like, well, I don't know why GTA got rid of most of all that, you know? But yeah, I, I just went bowling, man. I take my bike and let's go out to the city, man. Yeah, that was a sieve. Little pigs, little pigs. Where you at, like, man? And y'all better not say it, not better hear me ching, 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 because I'm coming in anyways, fucking pigs. What you guys do with Dickie, man? I know you guys arrested him. I know he's in the jail cell. What you do with him? <laughs> I 
know there's gaps. I see them in, in, in the fucking parking lot, man. deceive me oh no my eyes didn't deceive me Larry's RV ladies and gentlemen holy cow let's go check this out holy cow now this is what we need and I think Wisconsin's the one that has the one that replaces the building this is the same building with the MLO, there's where Larry makes his crooked deals and schemes you ain't paying 10 times extra the price for the car. <laughs> I could have swore I heard another door open. There's the big TV right there. There should be like, to be honest with you, this is pretty legit. Why ain't there a, like a like a little love seat right there, like a two seater love seat, or like two chairs? It's pretty cool. It's back here. Oh, it's like the shipping area where they keep oh surveillance cameras, wouldn't it? That yeah, that is legit. It replaces Larry's with Larry's, but a uh, MLO of Larry's. That is. Awesome. I know my eyes weren't deceiving me. I know I'm a little old, but they weren't deceiving me, man. You gotta keep your eyes out. You never know what you're gonna come across. I'm pretty sure this is standard inside, but I'm still gonna come by and check. Yep. Got some hotels here. Let's see. Yeah, I think they're standard. Yeah. I, I mean, I'm gonna try. Just, just because I want to try. But yeah. No, I was correct. I know what my GT looks like. How many years has this game been out? I mean, how many years have we played it? So that's what's up. So the bowling alley with the new MLO. Uh, other than uh, the RV, it's brand new. Only other thing I could say, if there was going to be other MLOs out here in the county that I would think of, would probably be here or the trailer park. If, okay, let's see. Someone needs to make an MLO of the Ark, I swear. That would be a cool, like a pet store. And then, like, I know that there's a way that you could probably, like, out of RP, like, mod the game and put, like, uh, the spawned in animals, like, in cages and whatnot, you know? So it, you could, like, animal shop, you know? Just check this out. It looks stock. Yeah, it said stock. You never know, you never know, you're as good to see me, man. Now, let's stop, yes. Uh, let's go check up here. Sometimes there's the biker place that they put here in some of the states that I've tried. No, it's just the standard gas station where you fill up and whatnot. Alright. Only other place I could uh, think of some new MLOs would be uh, the trailer park, maybe? Other than that, I don't know. Snipe you first. He's got some good hiding spots with all these MLOs. I wonder if I could find a list. I'm pretty sure. I gotta, I gotta do some digging. I gotta see if someone has... Can we... Is my eyes deceiving me? And they are not deceiving me. So that garage opens, right? If it opens, it's parking. Yeah. Oh. And you can fix your car. Okay, well, I'm gonna just park it in the park again. That is dope. All right, let's go 
check out this house, man. Another MLO. Fuck. Uh. Oh, it's locked. Is that someone? Can we actually get houses? I don't know if we can or not, but I'm going to split up vehicles real quick because it's raining and I don't want to drive a motorcycle. No, I, I would switch to a classic van, man. I believe this is registered. We'll find out if I get the over, I guess. So I guess that is someone's house. It may be a personal, to be honest with you. I'm not sure if we can get houses in this area, but I'm going to have to ask uh, Snipey first. I know there's some places you can get. There's a lock on that. I mean, my eyes weren't deceiving me once again. I saw we can go in there. So I was like, fuck. Different. Ooh, whoa, whoa, what, what? Okay. What? That's different. What is this? Oh, shit, man. I think the last upgraded, man. I don't really talk to them no more. That's what they fucking did back in. Oh, my God. You can go up here too. Okay. Can't really do none up there. There's tanks. Oh, shit. This looks like basically like the garages that are uh, in game, but just a little better, you know? Alright. Let's go check out the rest of this place. Oh, nice. There's the good. There's boxes right there. Got a flag in the window. Got some posters in the wall. Got lost. Holy cow. What's in here? Oh shit. It's like literally like a hangout place. Let's see what's in this door right here. Oh, the bathroom. To here. Oh, there's a bar. Oh. A little change area. This section looks a little familiar from a bar that is another MLO that's in a different spot here. And the trailer parks that I saw in another server. But, and then this must take you inside the room with the chairs. Yep. Okay, that's pretty dope. And this is the front. And it looks like, if I'm not mistaken, this may or may not be one of the scripts that OCRP has. I'm about to go check these trailers out because OCRP has a trailer script where you can go inside all of these trailers in front of my eyes. That's what it looks like we could do. No freaking way. Let's go check it out, man. No way. Ha oh, ha! Nice. Yep, well, I know where Mickey's probably gonna live in the future. I said that bar maybe, but I don't know. I think a trailer would suit him better, to be honest with you. Or Mr. Gene Davis and Jimmy uh, Long come out here, you know. <laughs> watch them on my channel, they're neighbors that don't get along. It's probably the same in every trailer, but you know, I'm gonna check. Check like two or three out. Yep. I think they're all gonna be the same, just different trailers, but let's get in. This is really cool man. So all the trailers are gonna be the same from my understanding from what it looks like. Just the outside looks different. Oh then again? Uh, it's got two doors. Could it be different? Let's check. 
Can we go through the second room? So they might be a little different. Oh, okay. This is a storage room. What? So you cut half of the trailer off. Use it for a storage room? Could have had like two bedrooms? Shoot. I mean, hey. I guess there's no wrong with that, but I, that's, that's a bad design. In retrospect, cut like 25% of your trailer off and use it for storage. They all look the same, to be honest with you, so I'm not going to check them out. Yeah, they are. They are like the blue couches and whatnot. Oh, that is legit. Oh, I know God damn it, Danny's going to be happy about that, man. This is starting, uh, even though I got some personals, don't get me wrong. I mean, I would have said I got a lot of personals. I got like two different BMW bugs. Well, three, but the third one don't work, so that's broken. But two bugs, two different vans, a PD Cruiser, a GMC lifted van for the Vagos, and just the old man scar. And then like two bikes. Other than that, the rest of the personals are for the server admins or whatnot, but. I was able to get them for forty dollars. Nothing to really brag about. I had to pay forty dollars to get cars that should be for free. But as I say, if I was to have anything put in the server, and I would, I wouldn't care if anyone else had their hands on it. They could use it too. It would actually. Oh, is that garage actually open? Can we? Uh, that mean? Oh no. Can we go in here? That garage. Ah, uh, I got it open. I used to see. You. But yeah, man, everything that I've been coming across, man, it's amazing. I know this is basically a part three of the review, plus RP added to it. The later RP I do with my buddy, I have it dropping out on uh, one of the Mondays or Fridays, but stay tuned for that one to drop. That one was decent. I just wanted to drop it on a special day, because why not? He needs to get an MLO bar right there. I can tell you that for sure. Other than that, I mean, he's got a lot. Just having that bowling alley in the pool. You know, I mean, I haven't seen the darts work yet. He says they work. I probably got to go to the city. I don't know where in the city I'd have to go. But, I can tell you this for a fact that... I'm loving everything so far, and just with the pool and the bowling, let alone itself, that's all I care about to have, man. That's all I care about having, man. It's just those two things in the server. That gives me a lot of RP to just chillax and just chill with people and play pool and bullshit, you know? Go fill this van up and get low on gas. Fucking pig right there, man. Better not get hassled by them today. I swear, man. Feel it, this, this van man. Get some gas in here, you know. Damn. She, she's already got 42%. She's almost there. 4.5 gallons. I'm at $17. Twenty one dollars and that's six point five. It just it just keeps going, man.
It's a big tank, man. You should go to that, man. Damn. Almost $40 for, for a full tank. Could be a little bit over 40. I'm gonna go 55. No, I'm gonna do 60. $60 further up. Yeah, am I gonna be correct? We're at 50. I'm saying 60. Then again, it's gonna be a little bit over. I'm gonna go 65. That's my max. Yeah, it's close. Let's get back in, man. I think that cap is trying to stuck my plate. I swear to God, man. Fucking stuck in my plate, trying to see what type of play I got. Fucking pig. A few moments later. Still get a burger, man. Fuck what that pig's doing. Yeah, I, 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 I want your, uh, uh, what do you got? I want that spicy chicken sandwich, man. Thanks, piece of shit. I'm out of here. Hey, let's get out of here, man. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, shit. Did they call the cops on me, man? Oh shit, let's just play cool. Play cool. He's not behind me, is he? Okay, let's play cool, man. Play cool. I, th I think she called the cops me. I don't know if she did. Let's go get some gas, man. Oh shit. Oh fuck. What's going on? What's going on, man? Gentlemen, step right from the vehicle. Alright, man. What's going on? Just step over it back towards me. Slowly. Whoa. 
Okay, man. Okay, man. Do not move, sir. Turn around. Okay, man. Okay. On your knees. On your knees. On your knees. Okay. Okay, man. Okay. You got my cover all cuffed. What's going on, man? No, please. Stand right there. We just got a call. We're just trying to figure it out. Go ahead, Deputy. You can, um, got him. I'm scared. No, All right, just give me a second. Do you want you guys to have a cage unit? We can put them in in a minute. Fuck. Yeah, I got a cage and a charger over here. I don't want to go to jail, man. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> I still... All right, sir. Just want to let you know that we got a call in regards to a um, vehicle that was stolen and you didn't match the description. Leaving burger shop. Oh yeah, I didn't pay for that burger. The guy was being an asshole. So I spit in his face and I told him to fuck off and I walked out. He was hassling me, right. man. All right. So is this the so the vehicle came back that you was driving matches the vehicle that you did steal from Burger Shop. I mean, I'm admitting I did steal. The guy was being he he was on his phone. He had his headphones on. He was being lazy, so I didn't pay for it. I spit out and called him lazy. All right. So at this time, um. You are being under arrest for for Grand Theft Auto at this moment. Grand Deputy, that's are you my, able at the time you have the right to remain silent? Anything you say will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to our, for an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be appointed to you by the by the state of Wisconsin. Do you have any questions at this time for either myself or the the other deputy on the scene? Well, yeah, you said stolen vehicle. That van's not stolen. That's my van, man. Well, from what the call came in, and that's what happened, and that, that's what we have to go by. Damn, man, that's my van from Indiana, man. Hey, have you searched the uh, van? Hey, don't search my don't van, search man. Van, well, at this point, we have probable cause uh, due to the call that came in. Come on, you're not gonna like what you see in there. Yeah. <laughs> I told you guys I'd get some interaction before I end this video. Mickey always goes to jail. Yeah, the original call came in for, he, like you said, he stole the real call and that's what the, the call came in about. No, it was about food. I could have, I got the video. No, not yet. I didn't even say nothing about it. I said a guy leaving a yellow van. I stole a burger. That, that's my van, man. Okay. Yeah, I'm uh, so you want to do that? Can you run the K9 through around the vehicle to see if there's anything else that's in there that we can't see? 
Fuck, no, no, don't, don't. Okay, yeah, let me get, yeah, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> All right, man. Was that your weed in the? Yeah, that's my weed, man. Don't don't take it. It's mine. Uh, well, you know it's illegal. Oh, it's illegal here. I didn't know that, man. Unless you have your medical card. Do you have your medical card? Uh, I left that back in Indiana, man. Well, it's not gonna do any good here. No. Oh, and what about the open beer cans, buddy? Uh, the, well, those are from like two days ago. I was partying. I never just never cleaned it out. All right. So you're not drunk? No, I'm far from drunk. I wish I was drunk right now. And you know it's illegal to run around with uh, open containers of booze, right? I didn't know that. I mean, they're all empty. I know, but they're open containers, meaning they were consumed possibly in the van, yeah? Well, I live in the van. Okay, well, in the state of Wisconsin, it's illegal to drink and drive, also meaning you can't have an open container of alcohol in the van. You understand that? Oh, damn, I, I didn't know that, man. All right, it's all fair. We're just gonna have the canine uh, take a peek at your car, make sure there's nothing else in there. There's nothing else in there we need to be aware about, is there? Nah, man. There's nothing. That, nah, man. All right. You don't have anything on your person, do you? I'm gonna get you out of the. Nah, I don't got nothing on me, man. Whoa. What's going on? Uh, not too bad. Give me one second. Somebody that's uh, got a hold of you. Oh, I was like, where did he go? Yeah, I have him. You said you can't grab me. Only he wants to grab me. Yeah, I've still got a hold of him. If you just want to grab him, I'll have him walk over. Him. Yep, not a problem. Okay, man, you should be good now. Come over here and stand in front of my charger, would you? Yeah, I'm um, not getting anything back on, so. Um, All right, so. Go ahead and just face the hood, if you would, please. Face All right, the man. All right, you don't have anything on you that's going to poke me, stick me, or hurt me, dude. No, all I got is my AD on me, man. All you got is your what on you? She's my ID, man. All right, all right, Mickey Flower. Yeah, it's my name. All right, man, you can just just relax right there. All right, man. All right, Johnson. Since you were the primary, <laughs> here's the thing. Yeah, he had no. Yeah, dog, man, find anything. So vehicle is clean. All right, Mickey Flowers is his name. You want me to transport him to the station for you? Yes. <laughs> Fuck. All right, I'll go put him in a holding cell and let him know you'll be with him shortly. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Told you I was going to jail. <laughs> All right, buddy, I'm going to go ahead and take you down to the station, Art. All right, man. I'm sorry, man. It's all good. You just got to use your head in these situations, right? Yeah, I guess I got to start using it. I had a rough life, a rough path. I'm, uh, I'm, to be honest with you, I'll be honest with you, officer. I'm a criminal in like five different states. All right. Well, have you ever thought about seeking help for that kind of behavior? I mean, every time I try, and I don't know, it just I end up going back to it, and I don't know why. I wish I didn't. All right. Well, there's a there's a pretty good place down in Florida I know of that's a really good rehab facility for almost anything you. They might have to try it out, and I want to let you guys know, be on the lookout, my brother may be somewhere around here, his name's Dicky Icky Cheese, he's probably doing drugs right now. Alright, thanks for that. So I'm just going to go ahead and transport you here into the holding cell until that other officer can come and do the paperwork. Or... Alrighty, man. Yeah, but I figured I'd let you know about my brother, I don't want him to do some bad drugs, and we went to, uh, I forget where we went, but we went to a hotel somewhere, and he, he did some glass, and it cut his throat, and he almost died. Yeah, so I figured I'd let you guys know, so if you guys get a call, I don't want him to die, man. It's my brother. I've known him since the 70s. We go way back from Coachella. Alright, man, if you just want to go ahead and walk up those stairs towards those white doors for me. Hey, man.
Usually I'm getting shoved in these weight doors. That's not the kind of cop I am, man. I appreciate it. Alright, you're just gonna go left down these stairs for me, alright? Yeah, we make a left and make a right, right? Uh actually you're gonna make you're gonna make that immediate right and go straight to the gate. Oh, okay. I've been to a place similar to this, I think I'd make a right to go to the sales. Yeah, but I'm just gonna just gonna put you in this holding cell over here. Go this way? Yep, to the right right here. Yeah, see, this is what I talk about. I've, I've, I've been to a place like this before. It's, I mean, it's probably not this place, but it looks familiar. Right, if you just want to go ahead and step inside. Hey, man. And go ahead and come to the door and face away from it, and I'll take those cuffs off you. Hey, man. All right, man, just hold tight. That other officer will be here shortly, all right? All righty, man. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. This is about to end the video. I hope you all liked some of the new MLOs I found. This is part three plus a little bit of, uh, you know, what? Okay, uh, yeah, but yeah. Basically, a little bit of part three showing off some more MLOs I found and a little bit of RP towards the end. I figured why not. There's probably ten times more MLOs that are probably around in this map that I do not know about yet. But I found some more. It's like a game of hide and seek. Snipe you first. I'll find you. And I know where all your MLOs are. I'll find them. I'm gonna look. Don't worry. I'm loving all what you're doing, man. I'm definitely loving what you're doing, man. This is Mickey going to jail and a different side of Wisconsin, not Wisconsin State Roleplay. Badger State Roleplay, which is a different part of Wisconsin than WISRP's in. So, another part of Wisconsin that I got charges choked up on me. Apparently, I stole that van. That's what they're going by. It is, that was my van, man. It, literally, I said that. I mean, I didn't say he stole the van. I mean, I might have to go back and check that car. <laughs> I could have swore to God I did not say that I was going to. Uh, I didn't. I don't think I put steal the van. I put stole steals the chicken sandwich. I put leaving in a yellow van, but they got the car. They must have got it wrong, or the, the whoever snitched on me didn't snitch right. Which out of RP, it was me that snitched, so it really was me that didn't snitch right, I mean, I, put, I stole a chicken sandwich, leaving the burger shot, and I, I thought I put leaving in a little van, I could have sworn. I mean, I was in the middle of hurrying up and trying to type that, because the cop was sitting there doing some sketchy stuff. And he must have saw that OC I put in, I'm still in the burger, so. I'm not the burger, the chicken sandwich, so. Fuck. I don't know. I don't know. But I wanted Mickey to get interaction with the cops. And I drove around for a while, which all that part stamped out, so you didn't see it in this video. But I drove around during nighttime with my lights off. And it took me a while to get pulled over. I finally did. Because I well, stole that burger. Or the chicken sandwich. One question is, as I see here, look at this fucking cop. What are their jail cells we're gonna look like? That I have not checked out. That was one place I didn't expect when we did part one and two to go check the jail cells. Usually in every server there's different type of jail cells that they have. Fuck. They said they stole my van. How could they steal my own van? It makes no sense. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to go back and check. <laughs> I told you. All right, Mr. Flower, just bear with me. Um, did the deputy take the cuffs off of you or not yet? Yeah, I got the cuffs off of me, man. 
Okay, you still got them on or you got them off? No, I got them off. Oh, okay. Just give me one second. I'm going to um, let you know what's going on in a second. Alrighty, man. Cause I want to know exactly what's going on. They said I stole my own van. Can I go back and see what I said? I want one man in a yellow van seen cleaving for her shot. Looks like a hippie. Yeah, stole a chicken sandwich. I never said anything about anything about stealing the van. That's my van, man. I didn't, I mean, apparently I must have, but I didn't know what he was talking about. Like, I thought he was talking about the sandwich, but then he said the vehicle. I'm like, wait a minute, that's my van. He was like, that's what, no, the call didn't come in like that. It's fucked up. <laughs> to be honest with you, they, they, I think they kept using the, I think he's using his badge. He's using that badge, he's got that badge on <laughs> type deal, you know? I don't know. What the, yes, sir. Yes, I didn't say nothing. Uh, okay. That's yeah, you was speaking to me. A few moments later. Alright, Mr. Flowers. So, um, who was going on today? So you guys he was gonna be charged with um the drug possession. Um, which is which is a felony and then you guys wanna get a and one the you guys be an um infraction of a the open container. No, oh, damn. So, damn. Yeah, so because you had the open container on the vehicle, um, from what the other deputy saw, that's all we have on you at the moment. So just bear with me. I will let, um, the total jail time we'll be doing is 90 seconds. So just bear with me while I get the report done and I'll be back with you. Do you have any questions for me? Yeah, I'm not going to jail for stealing my own van, am I? So, um. Because that's, that's my van. van. Alright, give me one second. I ain't going to jail for that, man. That's fucked up. I'm having a good time with this officer right now. He doesn't... I have no problems with him. It's just... I want to make sure I'm going to jail for exactly what I'm, I should be going to jail for. That 911 call states, if I go back up... Uh, I'll show you guys one more time during the video. So this will be three times you had seen it. So 911 man in a yellow van and then seen leaving the burger shot and then I put it looks like a hippie and then he stole a chicken sandwich and nowhere near in that I talked about a van like no hey, I talked about a yellow van right. what's going on so, um, do you know your license plate on that vehicle? S T one C K Y Z stickies, but the I is a one. Oh, okay. Yeah, it should be in the registration, man. I go everywhere in that van. That's my home. Yeah, that is a staple for me and Dicky. Besides, in Indiana now, we got the fucking Volkswagen bus. But in any other server, it's the GTA fucking vans, man. And that's the very first car, no matter what server I join, that gets registered to him. And 99% of the time, he's gonna be in the van and nothing else. It's just what he drives, man. Alright. So they just, um, my dispatcher let me know that. So, the vehicle is good, but for reason, um, you don't have a sure tied in. So that is gonna be another. Um, so at this point, like the vehicle cannot be dry because you have no insurance at all. Well, on the vehicle. Was, was you aware of that? Yeah, I was aware of that. I was actually going to get me a burger, and then they caused the problems. And yeah, I admit it. I stole the burger. I should have never had done that. But then I was gonna get some gas, and I was actually heading down to Morris Mutual to get some insurance. Oh, okay. Because I just, yeah, so I, just, I just came from yeah, Indiana and whatnot, Indiana. so I'm just moving out here. I'm getting everything switched over and set up, you know. Not that we understand. Um, 
you know, so just give me one more, give me a few more minutes and I'll be back with you. Alrighty, man. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. I stole the chicken sandwich, I admitted to that. I said I'm sorry. I'm going back to the Mickey and LA days, telling all these cops to sorry. Like, I'm sorry, man, they didn't mean to, I'm sorry. And uh, I'll do better next time, but then not do better. I had, the only person I really did that to was Bites. And I'm gonna start doing it to all these other cops now, they're just apologizing. Like, I'm doing these crimes, I know I'm messing up, I know I shouldn't be doing them, but I wanna do them because I need the money. And plus, things happened in my past where, you know, so, you know. I should have told him about me killing him on. Uh, that'll, that'll be another. That'll, that'll, that'll be another time. He just knows I'm in a criminal in like five different states: L.A., Wisconsin, North Georgia. Technically, I mean, it, I would, I would say, uh, fucking uh, Central, but I mean, not really. I mean, in a sense, yeah, but no, they're not L.A. anymore. So technically, no, but. For sure, uh, another than Ventura, L.A., uh, another than Wisconsin State role play, Indiana State role play, North Georgia role play, and then other than that, it's now going to be this uh, server. So so far, yeah. So as I said, correction, yeah, five. I was correct. And this is about to be six, so six servers, I'm technically, in. unless you count the other two LAs, because we had like three or four different LA servers, but, but it was all the same CAD and everything, so, but other than that, I mean, yeah, I got some interaction with them, as I said, so, I'm just waiting for me to go to jail, and I want to see what the jail cells look like, and that's where I'm going to end the video, ladies and gentlemen. And said my goodbyes, but yeah, I, I definitely didn't steal my own fucking van. <laughs> like, no, and I didn't put that as a car. Like, yeah, you can get me with the weed, you can get me with the cans of open containers. Like, me and Dickie always have open cans in our van. If it was like one of the, the other cars I have for the server, which I want to RP that I bring out in the future, like, yeah, hey, look at the custom car I got, man. Like, the remember this car from back in the day? I found it in this like storage shed. Tuco, Tuco was looking around. He knew that the card was somewhere. He, it was a rundown place that he stored it at. He just forgot where it was. And then pull it out. I definitely want to do something with the bike that you saw earlier. If that's the part I do put inside this video. Which I'm probably going to put it in. It, yeah. Because that's when I went bowling. So. Um, you're going to see the bike that I want to RP with more of it in the future. It's an old school bike. It's around the same years as the old school hippie vans. Um, but uh, I got a few other muscle cars that I, I'm not sure which one I want to make exactly physically his because there's a few that I like and it's like oof oof now my brother goddamn it Danny for Dickie he's found an old school muscle car for the future he could RP with because it used to be someone in, in his families and he wanted to resemble that hey he got a similar car to what they had out of RP because it's something that he could say that in IRL that he's he was told that he has and whatnot, or someone in his family has, and seen pictures and whatnot about it and whatnot, you know? Or heard stories about it. With me, sadly, none of those muscle cars, I don't believe, I mean, someone in my family may have owned them, but as far as I know, I, I can't tell you. That's a 100% yes. It's a 50-50. It could be yes, it could be no, I don't know. But it is when they would get charged for, for legit, man. He said 60, 60 months. Which, that's 60 seconds, I believe. Which, that's a minute. Or a little bit, yeah, like a minute. If, if that's what he is originally going to put me in, I mean, it may change. I don't know. I mean, because I told him I had no insurance. Apparently, he's talking to me. I don't know what, he's writing the report up. So, he's writing something good up for me. Alright, sir, thanks for your patience, Mr. Flower. So, um, at the time, you are going to be um, charged with the possession of the drugs, which Damn. is 90 days in jail, 90 seconds in jail. Um, you is going to have an infract. You have two infractions. One is going to be for the open containers, and the other one is for the insurance. Um, uh, vehicle insurance uh, not active. 
So those are the two charges right there. Um, both of the other two um, are just site infractions. So you would be, um, so that is not, um, so for the open container, there is a um, $250 fine on that one. Oh, and then for the, and then for the real code without, for the real code insurance, that's an also an infraction, which is a $500 fine. How long so do I got the bail? Say that again. How long do I got? Do I got to pay this? Yep. So I'm getting what? all this. Um, so it's all going to be on the the one. So you're going to. And then also there is okay. a fine as well because of the drug. So that's $100,000. I asked him when am I going to pay So it? that's a $10,000. So you okay. have a total. Your total fines is $10,750. Oh, um, due to the other one is um, the other two just an infraction. The open container and the vehicle just a traffic infraction. Um, you know, just an infraction. So those are the lowest. The reason why it's over ten thousand is because of the um, drugs. What if I can't what if I can't pay it? Um for which one? For the I would I would say I would say any of them. Like I'm I live in a van, man, I'm broke. I mean, I could try to scratch up some change or try to pay it, but what if I can't? Am I going to go to jail? No, I definitely understand. Uh, so what you can do is, um, you can, um, on your next court date, you, is gonna, you can be able to talk with the judge, let them know, arrange, um, you know, what is going on if you're not able to pay it, to see what options they have for you. Alrighty, man. Alrighty, man. So I'm gonna do is get this completed. I'll get you jailed, and then you should be good to go. Alrighty, man. So that means that do you have any questions or anything like that that I can answer for you at this time? No, you answered all my questions for me, man. All right. Fuck, man. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do all this. No, I just need your, your, your ID number. Yeah, yeah, one second, man. Uh, I believe it's going to be uh, number six. All right. Oh shit! Oh shit! Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, look at this cell. That's see, that's why I want to go to jail quick before I end of it. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Oh shit! We can play pool in the prison. That is legit. Ah, ha ha! This is cool. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, I think I'm gonna go uh, in here. Let's see. Jesus. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. So, there you have it. We'll explore more later in another video. But this is part three of the review plus my roleplay experience. I really enjoyed it. I'm going to give this server, to be honest with you, a 10 out of 10. The cop was really enjoyable and nice and whatnot. And... I love the jail. I love all the MLOs. I'm enjoying it. This is going to be, a, to be honest with you, my new home, if not my second home, that I'm going to play the majority of the time, just like I do in Indiana, because I love both of those so far. So other than that, ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will see you all next time here at Badger State Roleplay. And see you all later.